off of turn number four, the Whitesboro Plow Shop Dirt Car 358 Modifieds are green. Off of turn number two, it is Jeff Sykes, the race leader. As they head up into turns three and four for the very first time, Sykes, Preston Forbes, Jared Herbison cracks the top three as they click off lap number one. As they head up off of turn number four, we're back to green. Jeff Sykes' great run continues, but here comes Cousin Tim up on the top side. Fuller going from 15th, he's now to the two spot. Clears Jordan Kelly into turn number three and four. The St. Lawrence Radi Radiology GNR Auto Parts 19 has been stout all night long. Starting position has been the only thing that has slowed Tim Fuller down. Ten more remain. Jeff Sykes with a lead, but for how much longer? That's the question as Fuller continues to show his muscle late in the going. Fuller now to second. Third is Jordan Kelly. Still a sensational run for Kelly as they head up into turn number three and four and across the line. Nine to go for Jeff Sykes. Fuller giving chase from second. He is right there to try to challenge him. Fuller goes to the inside lane up into turns one and two. Sykes trying to keep the lane up on the high lane. He will keep the number one spot as they hit the back straight away. Family affair at the front of the field. Jordan Kelly watches from third. Derek Webb, Ryan Bartlett, that's your top five. As they exit turn number four and across the line, Tim Fuller, a great run off the bottom, clears Jeff Sykes in front. 17 down, Fuller the new race leader. The 2021 Whitesboro Plowshop Dirt Car 358 Modified Track Champion trying to get to victory lane. He's had a dominant race car all night long. And the man out of Edwards, New York, heads up into turn number three and four. He started 15th on the grid. And Tim Fuller will park it in victory lane here at the Can-Am Speedway. Tim Fuller gets the win. Second will go to Jeff Sykes. Third will be Jordan Kelly. Derek Webb, Lance Willick's your top five.